Hello viewers, what's up? Today I will start working with this panel. You see, whenever I click any of the table, the value of student ID like 143003 are set to this text fields and also in this box it is a combo box so in this lesson I will show you how to set values of a table into a J text field so let's start working open your net pins and you see we need one two three four five levels and five text fields for one column and for second column we also need one two three four five levels and five text fields that means we need 10 levels and 10 text fields student first time last time department series okay let's make it larger and then take a level and put it here it's good and then go to edit text student id and then take a text field go to edit text and make it null then resize it now copy the text field and the label copy paste again paste it and paste student id first name for this last name department series let's resize the text fields I'm going to make it slightly larger Control plus Z. What's wrong with the And then I'm going to copy all of the labels and text fields. Copy and paste. Then put it. here and now I am going to rename the text case, height, weight, gender, blood is height weight gender
blood. Now I will reposition the text fields. I think it looks better. Let's go to source and run the program. And you see we have chosen 10 labels and 10 text fields. Now I am going to rename the text field. For this text field, click, right click and go to change variable name and I am changing it to text is is to print id and i'm going to copy it copy control c and then paste it student f name okay Ctrl V L name student depth series is Wait. Gender. And blood. Oh. For gender, we need a combo box, not a text field. So click it and then delete it and then go to palette and take a combo box and put it here make it larger and then change variable name i'm changing it to combo student gender and then go to properties and you see this is the model click here and by default here are four items but we need to insert only two items male and female okay close and then go to source and run the file So today I have shown you how to take the labels and text fields and make a window for the information of a student. In the next video I will complete the tutorial of showing the values from a database table into a JTEX field. Until then keep watching and please don't forget to subscribe.